Welcome to the Rebel to Succeed podcast. It's your boy, Inc. Anthony Williams, the founder of RebelToSucceed.com. The purpose of this podcast is to share tips, advice, and strategies to help you improve in all areas of your life. My mission is to make a positive difference in your life to help you live your best life. Now let's get it. What up, what up, good people? Today, we're going to be talking about, um, um, we're just going to be talking about some things that uh, I feel like a lot of people need to, um, some people need to focus on, man. Um, One of the main things is, uh, uh, you know, being a self-motivator. You know, people need to, I feel like people need to, uh, you know, be a self-motivator. The importance of self-motivation and the importance of uh, using that to um, change your life, man. You know? Um, what is self-motivation? First of all, self-motivation is is, is quite simple. <laughs> it's quite simple. Um, it's the ability to motivate yourself. You know, be able to drive yourself and to... Um, to get yourself out of bed, to get yourself out of a uh, out of slump, is to basically to be able to motivate yourself to be able to do the things that you need to do to be able to achieve um, some of your goals and, and achieve some of the things that you want to achieve. Um, and I mean, it's, it's, it's that simple. You know, it's, it's self motivation. Um, also, self discipline. You know, we're gonna be talking about a lot of. Things that, that require you to look at yourself today because it's a very important uh, it's a very important topic. You know those two things there is is is, is very important in itself. It's self motivation and self discipline. You know um, what a lot of uh, a lot of the things that people miss um, with with uh, you know achieving their goals and achieving things that they want to achieve in life is they miss the fact that um, it all really boils down to um, yourself, you know what I mean. You you have to be able to look in the mirror, and you have to be able to assess yourself. You have to be able to point the finger at yourself, and uh, you know basically uh, criticize you. You know what I mean. Criticize you, and don't be afraid to um, shed light on your weaknesses. Shed light on the things that you're not good at. And uh, to work on those things, you know, I know uh, that's something that I've had to, uh, you know, overcome in the, in the past is um, being able to just to say that I'm, you know, I'm not good at this or I'm not good at that or I'm not I'm weak in this area um, and, and I need to improve in this area. You know, it's it's, it's OK because, because um, you know, that's how you um, improve. That's how you change. That's how you get better is when you. You know, you know, come to terms with reality and to determine what uh, what is working for you and what you need help with. You know, that's that's just one thing in itself is a lot of people, they don't even want they don't even want to ask for help, man. You know what I mean? Like it's something that uh, it's something that, um, um, you know, it's, it's going to hurt them. <laughs> like it, People don't even want to ask for help, man. Like it's it's okay to ask for help, and it's okay to need help sometimes. You know what I mean? Like you 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 can need some help. Like we are not perfect. Um, I know I talked about that. Uh, um, I think I may have talked talked about that in in the other episode. But I, you know, I love to um, reemphasize some things because you know, for me, um, reemphasizing some things helps put. Um, it just put a stamp on that subject, you know what I mean? And it's okay to need help, man. It's okay to actually need help, you know what I mean? Like, don't be afraid to ask for help. But um, people, I feel like um, we all should uh, we all should become very good at um, self motivating ourselves to do whatever it is that we need to do because. Um, we are responsible for whatever we do. 
We are responsible for our results in life and in and, and, and anything that we do. You know, we are responsible for it and can't nobody else control what we do. You know what I mean? Like really at the end of the day, you make the decision to do whatever you do. And you make the decision to get up out of bed and to go uh, work towards your goals, to go work towards whatever it is that drives you. You know what I mean? Like it, it, it's it's all about you. You gotta you gotta you gotta get yourself fired up, man. You know what I mean? Because um, all the time, not everybody is going to be in the same mental space as as you are. You know what I mean? Um, I know I heard I heard a, a as I'm as I'm talking right now. I thought of a, a something that I've heard. A, you know, a rabbit that I like to listen to at some point. Um, his name is uh, Drake, and he used to say Drake used to say. Uh, um, he said, he said, uh, somebody told me nobody's working as hard as you. And even though, I, and, no, and even though I laugh it off, man, it's probably too, it's probably true. <laughs> I'm not messing up his lyrics, but he said, uh, yeah, he said, uh, somebody told me nobody's working as hard as you. And even though I laugh it off, man, it's probably true. And I mean, it is true. You know what I mean? Because you are the only person that can, you know, uh, that can work the way you work, man. It's it's all about you, man. Like that. I mean that that in itself, right right there, is just it's it's you, it's you, it's I, it's me, it's you, it's the person. You know what I mean? You are really what uh what drives you. You know what I mean? You are really what drives you, and you have to be willing to uh, be hard on yourself and to be able to point the finger at yourself. I know a lot of people they like to. Um, a lot of people like to uh, point the finger, man. I was I was that person as well, you know what I mean. And um, sometimes I still make the mistake and point the finger, and I gotta check myself, you know what I mean, because that's not even right, man. Like if you if you live your if you live your life pointing the finger at somebody else all the time, you're going to um, you're gonna live your you're gonna live. Uh, you're gonna live a, a just a negative life. There's nowhere else I can I can't put it any better way. <laughs> like when you point the finger all the time and it's always somebody else's fault and it's oh it's it's he's the reason why I didn't make it or or she's the reason why I didn't get the promotion or 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 he's the reason why this didn't like it. Stop pointing the finger, man. Somebody you know, I used to always hear like in, back in the day like yo when you when you point. When you point the finger at somebody else, you always got like three fingers pointing back at you. Like, remember that. You know what I mean? I mean, it's some, it's, 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 you know, it's, it's cliche or whatever they want to call it. But I mean, it's, it's true, man. You know, you when you point the finger, you got, you got, you still got some point, fingers pointing back at you, and it, and it's all to emphasize the 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 fact that you are, uh, you're you are the reason. You know what I mean? You're really the reason, man. Like, don't point the finger. You you can live a more productive and, and positive and effective life when you always focus on um, or when you make your your uh, when you live your life with the perspective of it's all it's all because of me. You know what I mean? Like it's I hope I'm I hope I'm wording that right. Like I don't want to sound I don't want I don't want nobody to sound uh, uh, cocky. But, you know, li- live your life focusing on um, it's it's always uh, focusing on how can I put it? How can I put it? Focus your life on. Uh, things don't happen unless I make things happen. I hope you can under I hope you guys can understand that, but things don't happen unless I make them happen. When things happen, it's because of me. It's something that I could have did better. There's something that I should have did different. Like, you really can't focus on other people and expect things to change. Like, the only thing people... Like, okay, that's, 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 what, I'm, that's what I'm alluding to. Like, people need to, people need to, to realize that... Um, people need to realize that the only person that you can change is yourself. 
and I, I remember me saying this in a, in a previous video I might have did. Um, it might it might have been a Facebook video or, or something, but I'm, it's it's that that's the that's the key right there. You know, when you when you when you literally realize that I cannot change anything else but myself. I have no control over nothing else but myself and what I do. And what I do, not nobody else, what I do. Now, here's the kicker. I will say this, that when you when you actually uh, when you actually um, change yourself positively, you you do have the ability to uh, positively impact other people. And in, in turn, they could change positively. You know what I mean? But it's all a ripple effect. And it starts with you. That's the key. It's, it starts with me, not nobody else. I'm not pointing the finger at nobody else. I need to change me. Let's change me first. And then let's then through that, I can change other people. I can change my reality. I can change my perspective. I can change my life. I can change other people's lives. I can change. I can make some change. But it all starts and it all focuses on it all focuses on or the focus should be on what can I do to change me first for me to be able to change other things. You know what I mean? That's that's what you have control over. You only can control what you have can control what you have control over. So what you have true control over is you. And and that's why I, I wanted to talk today about the whole self-motivation and self-discipline is because it's all you. It's all you, man. It's all you. Nobody is nobody is uh no nobody is going to uh you know build your business for you. Nobody is going to uh get up and, and, and uh you know get to work for you. Nobody is going to change your life for you. Nobody is going to no, nobody's going to really do anything for you, man. I mean, it's, unless you're paying them, you know what I mean? Like it's like it's all you. It's all you. You you are in the driver's seat. You're in control. You're the one calling the shots when it comes to you. You know what I mean? When it comes to you, you have complete control over that, and you have to own that. You have to be okay with that. You have to accept that. You have to be in a in a state of peace. Knowing that, okay, my results are a direct re uh, my results are, are a direct um, effect of the things that um, that I do, and the things that I think, and the things that I believe, and the things that I do. How I act, my actions cause you know results. It's all you. So self motivation. You know, some people you you really need to focus on. Um, you really need to focus on basically uh, training yourself to think positive. You know what I mean? Like positivity, a positive thinking mindset. Is, I mean, it's just it's 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 invaluable because um, you know the root of the root of all results is 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 thought in itself. You know what I mean? You you can think things into in existence. Like uh, thoughts are things. Now that's that's a topic all by itself. You know, thoughts, thoughts are things. They are literally things. They create. They they are things. They create. You know what I mean? So don't, <laughs> man. Like if you if you if you sleeping on thoughts right now, like like just, yo, like wake it up, wake up, man. Like wake up for real. Like thoughts are things. Like your thoughts are probably. You know, one of the most important things that you create, your thoughts. You can literally use your thoughts to create a life of abundance, man. Like, it's it's crazy, but I don't want to travel down that lane right now. You know, the focus is self-discipline and self-motivation. I, I know I can talk, and I can talk, man. Even though I deem myself as not a talker, but I can talk. Where I, you know, I think my last episode, I did like two hours. And I, I didn't even realize it, but um, yeah, I mean, focus on, uh, you know, motivating yourself. Like some people, they don't realize that um, you have to, to achieve success, 
and to be successful in achieving your goals and, and, and certain things like that. And that perspective is that you have to be able to self-motivate yourself because, you know, some people, they're going to look at you like you crazy. You know what I mean? Like when you're trying to build something that's out of the ordinary, you know, it's not the norm, it's not normal. You have to be able to motivate yourself and to have that self-confidence, like, yo, like it's 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 all good. Like I know what I'm doing, I got this. Like I believe that this 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 thing is and this such thing is gonna happen. You gotta be able to motivate yourself, you know, not really focusing on what other people are saying or, or doing or thinking, and, and motivate yourself to keep moving in the direction that you need to to achieve the whatever goal that you that you want to achieve. That's what you gotta do, man. Like, man, don't don't worry about other people. Block other people out and focus on what you need to focus on. Where focus goes, energy flows. That's how it works, man. So um, if you focus on the negative and, and what other people are thinking, um, you're gonna create you're gonna create the energy and it's, it's and it's gonna it's gonna deviate you from your your end goal. And you don't want that. You don't want that, man. People are gonna talk. People are gonna hate. People are gonna do whatever they gotta do to bring you down. And you gotta be able to motivate yourself. And to discipline yourself to be able to withstand all of that bull crap and keep it moving. Like point blank period. Keep it moving. Point blank period. Like just keep it moving, man. So um self motivation is very important. Self motivation is very important. I had to I learned that um I learned that uh um I learned I'll say I I, I learned how to self motivate myself. And I'm, you know, I'm still actively self, I'm, I'm still actively learning how to do that. But I'm, I'm pretty good at it. You know what I mean? Like it's, it's times where I hear people and you know say certain things that might discourage me from doing what I'm trying to do. And I just, you know what? You know, I just go into my zone. Like you know what? Like it's, it's okay. Like they don't understand right now, or they're, they're not where I'm at mentally. And I keep it moving. You know what I mean? Because some people are not where you're at mentally. That's just how, that's just the reality. Everybody is on a is on a different um, mental scale right now, and I hope I'm wording, wording that right. Like, like yeah, like I'm, I, I'll say a mental scale. Like everybody's on a different level mentally. I'll say that they're on a different level mentally, and you know you may be on a different level. You know what I mean? You just may be on a higher level than somebody else. So it's it's okay. You know what I mean? The, the, the best thing that you can do. Is to um, not to preach to people. Um, you know, I, I really don't. I hope I'm not preaching to people. I'm just trying to share information and share knowledge. But um, you know, when 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 you're doing something, man, and, and people don't like you, you don't want to like like you don't want to tell people like, look, this is what you need to do. You know what I mean? And it's just, it's just like just preach to people and look. This is what you gotta do, and this is like, nah, man. Like, I, me, me personally, I would rather, you know, let my actions speak for themselves. You know what I mean? Like, that's the best. That's the best approach to um, um, dealing with other people and 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 their thoughts and their opinions, and to you know just respect other people's opinions. I mean, everybody has, is entitled to their opinion. And their, you know, perspectives and their thoughts. Now, I will say this. Now, what is, you know, what is irritating is when people offer up their opinions. <clears throat> is when, pe- is, uh, when people offer up their, their opinions and you never even ask for the opinion like that. Now, that is a little irritating. But, I mean, and then at that point, you might have to like, look, man, like I, I never even asked for you to, you know, I didn't ask for your advice or whatever. Like, you know, just, you know, you can keep it moving, whatever, what you doing. You know what I mean? Like, leave me be. Leave me alone. <laughs> Leave me alone. So, um, you know, you you got to be able to, uh, you know, put you know, put, sometimes you got to put people in their place. Let them know, like, look, man, just let me focus on what I'm doing and focus and really focus on what you're doing. You know what I mean? Like, don't allow that to affect your progress or your or whatever you're doing. That, you know, to to achieve your goals. So. Um, Self motivation, self discipline, man, like it's it's very important. Like the self, really, it, you know, really get in tune with what you got to do inside to be able to uh, 
make some progress happen so that you can help some people, man. Because like I said, again, that's what it's really all about. You know what I mean? I know. I, I think I said this. I've said, I think I've, I've remember saying this before, but I'll say it again. I love, you know, re- reemphasizing things is that you really can't help anybody else unless you help yourself first. And I don't want you to, I, I, I know sometimes that sounds selfish, but it's, it's the, uh, it's the way that it is. You know what I mean? It's it's the it's the way that it is. That's how it is. You got to be able to you know help yourself before you can help other people. So it all starts with you. But the end goal is to help other people. You know what I mean? That's the end goal. Because when you help other people, you in in tune. You help yourself. Like my man Earl Nightingale said. He said, "When you enrich others, you enrich yourself." You know what I mean? So, and then you gotta you gotta enrich yourself to enrich others. It's you know it's all like a little circle, man. It's all like it's a, it's a little circle. You know what I mean? That's how it works. Little little react, little chain reaction. So, um, you know, focus on that. Focus on that. You know, build yourself up. You know what I mean? Build yourself up, and be disciplined and stick to the things that you need to achieve your goals. Get disciplined, man. Like some people. Are literally, um, you know what? I point the finger at myself. I really point the finger on myself on this one is because I had a problem with, you know, starting something and just, and I didn't have the discipline to finish it, to see it through. That was one of the things that I had a problem with for a while. You know what I mean? Like, I've always had, here's my, I'll tell y'all my thing. I've always had, you know, the the thoughts. I've always had like an entrepreneurial spirit. I've always wanted to start my own business. I've always wanted to, you know, do my own thing. And over the years, in the past, I have came up with so many great ideas. Like I'm really good at coming up with ideas. Like this would be a great idea to do and start. And I started and I never had the discipline to see it through. I will always uh, quit. I will always quit or something else would come up that would seem like a better opportunity. And I will always just be like, ah, that, this is not working fast enough for me. And I would jump to the next thing. And th- that in itself, like, again, like you're never going to achieve your goal if you quit. You know what I mean? If you if you keep jumping from goal to goal to goal to goal to goal, you're not. I mean, if you keep jumping from. Yeah. Am I saying that right? <laughs> I know I'll be talking sometimes, but. Yeah, if you if you're jumping from thing to thing to thing, you're not going to achieve. Uh, you're not going to achieve any success because you keep quitting. You know what I mean? That that is that is a sure way to failure. It is if you just quit. Like let's say for instance, like if you just if your goal is to walk ten miles, and you 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 start out the first time and you walk two miles and then you quit. You didn't complete 10 miles. Then you, you you go again, okay, I found a better way I can do these 10 miles. And you tra- you go that way, and then you go five miles, and then you quit. And you just keep jumping on to idea and idea and, and this different way and this different way and this other way to c- complete t- uh, 10 miles, and you keep quitting. You're never going to achieve, you're never going to complete your 10-mile journey. Uh, you you got to just focus on one thing and just and work on that. You know what I mean? To have the discipline to not quit, like not give up. Like, how you expect to achieve anything if and you give up? You're never going to achieve anything if you quit. Point blank. Period. <laughs> That's my thing. Point. Point blank. Period. Point blank. Period. You're now. You're not going to achieve anything if you quit. It's not going to happen. I can guarantee you that. One hundred percent. You got to stick with it and you got to be disciplined to stick with it. And you got to motivate yourself to stick with it. That's how it works. That's how it works. That's how it works. So, um, yo, be self-disciplined, be self-motivated, be confident, like be like be empowered, man. Like don't 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 let don't let nothing knock you off your square. Don't let nothing knock you off. Your your goal. Don't let nothing knock you off your plan. You know, like you got to stick with it, man. You got to be disciplined. 
you got to be mentally disciplined. Like the mental aspect of it is probably the, like the, the 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 foundation of it, man. That's the that like that that right there is the, is the man. The, I mean, people miss the. Uh, I know people miss the whole mental aspect of of these things, but the mental aspect of the of these things is is probably the core of it. When you hear me speak about certain things, um. You know, I'm I, I'm referencing the mental aspect because it all it all starts with your with your thoughts in your mind, man. Like it's they don't realize it. I know I, I didn't realize it. It took me a while to realize it, but it starts with yourself and your mindset. It's all about the mindset and your thoughts. So um, you got to be you know self. You got to be mentally disciplined, mentally motivated. You got to be everything. That you need to be to be able to keep it moving, man. Like, let's go. You know what I mean? Let's go. Get motivated. Get hyped. Like, yo, you know, I'm gonna wake up this morning and um, you know, we're gonna we're gonna make it happen. You know what I mean? Whatever it is, you know, go get your go 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 get some results done, man. Like get get some get some stuff done. You know what I mean? Get some stuff, get some stuff done in your business. Get some stuff done, you know, at your job if you're working, you know what I mean? Get self motivated. Like if you you waking up, you gotta get this money. Look, man. Okay, I gotta get this money. I gotta go work for somebody else. But it's okay though. You know what I mean? Do what you gotta do right now. Be self disciplined. Be self motivated. Get up. Do what you gotta do. Get some stuff done, so that you can change your life, man. That's what it's all about. It's about changing your life for the better, and then impacting other people for the better. And when you get to that point, you you're at you're, you're at an all time high, man. That's what it's all about. It starts with you, though. It all starts with you. You got to look yourself in the mirror, and you got to be accountable for the things that you did. You look yourself in the mirror and be accountable for the things that you did. It's all you, man. It's all you. I know I, I sent out a... Uh, I sent out a... Uh, man, I came across this, uh, this, this, this positive, positive... Uh, this positive... Um, Quote that I, I came across online, man, and I thought that I needed to share it. And it and it, and it said, uh, it's, the quote said, uh, "Look in the mirror, and that's your competition." Yeah, it said something along those lines. Like, look, it said, "Look in the mirror, and realize that that's your competition." So, it's I mean, it's all you. That's really what the quote is saying. It's it's, it's you. It's all, it boils down to you. What are you going to do today? What you going to do today for these 24 hours? What you going to wake up and, and, and put out? You going to put out some positive energy or some negative energy? You going to get some work done or you going to play? You going to go hard or you going to bullshit? Excuse the language, but I mean, hey, some people need to, you know, pe- people need to feel it, man. Like, yo, what you going to do, man? Like self motivation, like get up out of bed, get some work done. We gonna watch TV all day, or we gonna get some work done. You know what I mean? What we gonna do? Let's 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 get to work, man. Let's get to work. Be be disciplined and be motivated to make some things happen to change your life. To change your life, man. That's what it's all about. So, yeah, man. I just wanted to give you guys. Um, Give you guys a quick, uh, quick tip on uh, motivating yourself and self discipline um, in this episode, and I hope you guys um, found some motivation and some and some uh, and some value in this in this episode. And uh, I encourage you guys to go out there and and make it happen, man. Make it happen. Follow your dreams. Chase your dreams. Chase whatever your goals are. Get some stuff done. Get some work done. Go get it, man. Go get it. Be a go get it. Go get it. You know what I mean? And, and don't let nobody knock you up off your square, man. I want to thank you for joining me today and listening to this podcast. If you found this episode helpful or valuable in any way, then I encourage you to leave an honest review and subscribe to the Rebel to Succeed podcast for future episodes. 
To receive more content and value, make sure to visit the Rebel to Succeed website at www.rebeltosucceed.com. And finally, always remember that to succeed in life, you have to reach everyone by exercising love. So make sure to show somebody some love today. Thanks again, and I'll talk to you next time.